Amplify Color provides full color grading at a level comparable to film and VFX. With Amplify Color, users can easily change the mood of their scene, without writing a single line of code. In this new version, we introduce some new features, such as Amplify Color volumes and mobile-specific optimizations. In this video, I will show you how to use the new features. To take advantage of mobile-specific performance improvements, simply change the quality settings in your Amplify Color effect script. This mode is great for older devices with high fill rate requirements. With color volumes, not only will you reduce production times, you will also empower your artists by allowing them to place different LUTs or color profiles per zone as required. In order to use color volumes, simply select your camera and check the box for Use Volumes. Now go to Game Object and create the Amplify Color Volume object. In the Inspector tab, you can select your LUT, Blend Duration or volume visibility in the scene. Let's place some volumes and see the effect in action. Now that we are done, I will adjust the volumes. In the corridor volume, I will apply a desaturate LUT. I will also adjust the blend duration to 5 seconds. Now let's see the volumes in action. As you can see, the room currently has the dusty orange LUT applied. As soon as you go into the corridor, Amplify Color will automatically blend into the desaturate LUT. As soon as you leave the corridor, Amplify Color will automatically blend back to the other LUT, in this case the dusty orange. The outside also has a volume with the blue contrast LUT applied. As soon as we leave the corridor, it will automatically blend into the new LUT. Amplify Color volumes are extremely flexible. They can be rotated, scaled, moved and even animated. While using volumes, if the camera leaves the volume, it will revert back to the LUT or color profile applied to your Amplify Color image effect. We also added a new inspector tab called Volume Editor. Here you will find a list of all the volumes in your scene. You can set their visibility or select them directly. In some projects, it may not be viable to have the camera inside the actual volume. This is why Amplify Color allows you to set a proxy object for position detection inside the volumes. In this practical example, as you can see, although there are volumes, as the player moves, the effect is not applied. This is because the camera is outside the range of the volumes. In this case, we will use the player mesh as a proxy for the position detection inside the volumes. Setting up a detection proxy is extremely simple. In this case, we simply have to drag the player object into the detection proxy slot. As you can see, the effect is now properly applied, since we're using the player as the tracking position for the volumes instead of using the camera. We hope you enjoyed this quick look at some of the new features available in Amplify Color. Visit Amplify.pt for more information and a fully functional trial version. Join dozens of other developers that already chose Amplify Color as their leading solution for color grading in Unity. Try it today!